Rabbit farming is an interesting activity. It needs less investment and space. Rabbit meat has good demand. Once you purchase the parent stock, the generation continues itself unlike in poultry. One can have the rabbit shed besides the house, since it is a silent and clean animal. It needs no land for grazing. Hence, it is suitable for people without lands. Even the women and children can manage the rabbit farm. It needs very less of ready-made food and eats locally available grass and vegetation. Rabbits adapt easily to most climates. They have no serious diseases or pest problems. It gives an early and reasonably attractive income. In spite of all these plus points, rabbit farming is not yet a popular enterprise. This is the cage system. Though the initial investment is more, it is better for commercial farms. Of course, this type of costly cages are seen only in government farms. Here, the systematic GI cage is being prepared by using 16 gauge mesh. The mesh roll is 50 feet in length and 4 feet in width. The mesh is cut into required size and tied with binding wire to give a cage shape. Avoid sharp edges inside the cage. This cage of 10 feet length, 4 feet width and 1 feet height costs about 2,500 rupees. This has 10 compartments of 4 square feet. It can accommodate 10 big rabbits. Verify whether the mother has fed the kittens with milk or not. The stomach of the kittens get round and the body remains warm after feeding. 30% of the rabbits do not give milk themselves. In such cases, put the mother on the floor and feed the kittens like this. Continue this thrice a day for a week or till they open their eyes. Kittens are mild for two days and become active later. They will not survive without the mother's milk. Hence, be sure to take enough care. Now, let us go through the economics of rabbit farming. Take a farm with 25 females and 5 males for calculation. Each female delivers 6 to 8 kittens each time and 5 to 6 times a year. This amounts to 40 kittens per year on average. Hence, we can sell around 1,000 rabbits per year by keeping 30 breeding rabbits. The young ones gain 2 kg weight in 3 to 4 months and are ready for selling. It fetches 100 to 125 rupees per kilogram. Each rabbit needs 6 kilograms of concentrated feed for 4 months. One worker can maintain a farm with 200 rabbits. Cost of production of one rabbit will be 60 rupees for feed, 30 rupees for management, and 10 rupees for medicines and other expenses. The total cost of production will be 100 rupees for each rabbit. These rabbits weigh at least 2 kilograms, each fetching a minimum of 200 rupees. Hence, one can get a net profit of 100 rupees from each rabbit.